guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Thirsty Thursdays. I'm your host, Ken Delomic. And over the last four weeks, as you guys know, we've been doing a whole bunch of taste tests of all these different uh, drinks that I picked up from a British import store in Newmarket, Ontario called Sweets in Store. Uh, the owner gave me four cans to give, give them a try. And you guys from the United Kingdom are loving it. And I'm loving the fact that I'm being international with you guys. Anyway, so today we're going to be doing D and B. I'm going to try and actually say this, these words here. People call it uh, Daldillion and, and, or N, uh, Burdock. Daldillion and Burdock. This is another product made by Barr. This can is, uh, it says energy, I'm trying to find the, oh there we go, 53 calories. So this is the lowest calories out of all the drinks here, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, one of them was like 114, another one was like 90 something. So this is, I think, the lowest calories, uh, 13 grams of sugar. This is probably, since it's bar, it's probably made in Glasgow. Yep, it's made in Glasgow. All right, guys, so I had a couple people comment as to what they thought it tasted like. Uh, well, at least one person that I can recall, and he said it tasted like licorice. A lot of people said it's uh, one of those things you either love it or hate it. Uh, so I cannot wait to get into this can. So these are 39p or three for one pound. I know the pound sign. All right, guys, here we go. We're going in for the D and B. Hope I didn't say anything wrong in that. But this is, oh, right off the top. Wow, power. Hmm, that smells like a candy store as well. Can't get candy stores out of my head. That smells like gummy bears. Hmm, actually, I can smell the licorice. When you, when you smell, when I smell these, these beverages, the first thing, because there's so much sugar in them, that's, it just smells like a candy store. Mmm. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. First time ever taste testing a DMB. First time ever trying it too. So let's check it out. I'm almost thinking that it's going to be dark, but we'll see. Yeah. It's uh, like a root beer um, look to it. Once again, I'll let the kids give it a shot and let them know what, let me know what they think of it. I like to no uh, teenagers points of view but again please leave a comment in the comment section below if you've tried this and uh, try to define what it tastes like the smell is actually amazing again it smells like a candy store like there's a candy store just north of us and uh, they got tons of candy and it's and it's all open bins and it just reeks this reeks like that store very nice okay here we go ladies and gentlemen first time trying a DMB just for you. Wow. It does take, taste like licorice. I'd probably buy this again just for the novelty of it because it is so different than anything I've ever tried before as a beverage. When, you, when it first goes in your mouth, you have that nice sweet flavor of uh, licorice and then it has this really weird kick at the end of it like a follow-up bitterish type taste I'm willing to bet my daughter will hate it Ben will probably like the first taste of it and then after that I won't probably won't like it um, would I said would I recommend this to you? I would I'm I would be indifferent. I would give this an indifferent. Uh, no, I wouldn't. I would I would recommend you try it just for the experience of trying something so different and so unique. And again, you can pick them up obviously in British import stores. Uh, if you can get if I can get it in Ontario, you could probably get it anywhere in a specialty shop. But this is, this is the most unique flavor out of all three, uh, of all four of these drinks. That is like, 
cool. I know a bunch of you will hate it, but I like it. Ding! Thumbs up for D and B. I actually like this pop. It has a really weird taste, and uh, but I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. There's another taste test for you. Another Thirsty Thursdays in the bag, as they call it, as I call it, as you call it. Anyway, guys, let me know in the comments below what beverages you want me to try. Uh, I think I'm going to try, uh, I got an actual, um, one of the companies uh, called Timothy's sent me a gift card because they liked the fact that I did a review of one of their coffees before Christmas. And uh, I, I said I was going to go and do the Red Velvet Latte and I will do that for the next Thirsty Thursday. So see you next Thursday, guys. Please keep leaving comments in the comment section below where you want me to go. And the more comments I get for one specific drink, that's the drink I'll do next. But next week, I'm going to be doing the Timothy's Red Velvet Latte. Thank you very much for watching KBD Productions TV. Thirsty Thursdays. Ken out. See ya. Bye.